And so I said, no, you've got the horn. Ha ha ha. Ha. Oh, why the long face? Get back to Terraria where you belong. Right. Um, hello, this is Jamie from randomizeuser.com, and we're back in Starbound for a straightforward, honest to goodness, let's play, instead of a weird one about the combat update and stuff like that. So we're just going to do a really straightforward play this time. Let's just um, actually use the elevator like a good boy. Um, right, so what we're going to do is we're going to build a colony on a volcano planet, the most dangerous planet of all, full of lava and horrors and stuff like that. So I'll just beam back to my ship. And we'll all have a good time. Uh, first of all, I've actually got to find a lava planet. Um, so let me just go and find that whilst I blather on some more. Right, we're currently over a... Um, I think we're over a snow planet at the moment. Yes, there we go. Um, so I'll just go back into the galaxy. Uh, oh, actually, there's, right, there's a fiery star right next to us. Uh, which is good because I've got bugger all fuel. Uh, okay. Oh, there we go. Straight off. 35. Oh, no. I haven't quite got enough fuel. Uh, okay, that's fine. I think I've got some in here. So let's just put that in there. That in there. And we're good to go. Right. Okay, so now let's go. Oh, just get on with it, you bloody bastard. <laughs> right, just reset uh, to the centre of the screen. There we go. Um, yeah, once it's discovered, you can actually press control and look around. Things became a lot more easier to see. That's a rather convenient thing to have. Uh, oh, God. Uh, people have pointed this out on my previous videos. Um, Please just ignore that. That's a, <laughs> I, I apologise for that immensely. Um, right, so as well as building a volcano colony, what we're also going to do is a couple of side quests where hopefully we're going to find a few ranged weapons. Um, I've got a bunch in my chest here, but I cheated these in, and I want to get them honestly. So I'm going to look for a boomerang in a chest at some point, and then I'm going to find a blueprint for one of these other boomerangs, and hopefully we'll have some good weaponry at our disposal. But that's not just yet, that's for later on. First of all, we've got to find a good place to build a colony, and everything will be groovy. Okay, um, all the equipment that I have is stuff that I've got left over from previous videos, so I haven't done anything special there, apart from get rid of anything that's kind of like a bit of a cheat that I admined into the game. So this is a, a fairly honest one, and this is using my existing character. That's a fairly high-level character. I thought there's no point in doing a Let's Play. Oh god, it's raining fire already. I don't, I don't think there's any point in doing yet another Let's Play of Starbound where you start from the beginning. This is quite an endgame character. God, these are bloody multiplying like bastards, and they can go through walls. This is going to be a nuisance. We're going to have to defend our colony quite well. Oh, no, it's one of you. As these can go through walls as well. Uh, right. I don't like this planet. Yeah, there are too many There are too many things that can go through walls. That's one of the, the considerations that I have to have, uh, based on my snow colony. Um, I didn't like that snow colony. Um... I still don't, and because um, it's just it snowed a lot and reduced the frame rate, and things kept on attacking from the sky. And I want to try and avoid that if I can. Right, here's a here's a different one. Hopefully, the baddies on this one will be a little less shitty. Right, we have just beamed down to this new planet. Looks a lot like the old planet. And I'm just going to put some torches down so I know where I beamed down. Right, let's have a look at this one instead. Oh no, it's you again. More wall go throughers. Bollocks! Ah, yeah, sod off. Sod off. I think we're going we're gonna to have to put up with this, aren't we? I don't, I don't think there's any way to avoid, on these really evil planets, I don't think there's any way to avoid this sort of thing. Oh, there's a particularly generated one down there. Okay. Oh, no, it's... Oh, these can go through walls as well. Oh, bollocks. Bollocks, bollocks, bollocks. <laughs> no, oh! And that's also a mountain from hell. Ugh. Oh, hang on, what's that? There's actually a chest down there. Uh, I'm not going to bother getting it. Um, it will involve a bit of a dig down. Uh, another procedure. Yeah, there. <laughs> a random one. That's easier to say. Uh, let's see what's in this chest. Uh, a nice little assault rifle. Yeah, it doesn't really do much damage. Uh, I'm just going to leave that there. To hell with it. So I need to find a site for my. God damn it. Damn it. <laughs> Thankfully, my, uh, my sword is very powerful. It's one that has this as a secondary attack. So it can go. Oh, gosh, that went for miles. I um, also found another chest with a... Oh! <laughs> that was... That was lucky. A Neo Chakram blueprint. Uh, I thought I thought that was going to take us several episodes to find. I found a blueprint for a Chakram. Um, which means I actually have to find a normal Chakram as well. Um, so, yeah, that's the side quest of this Volcano Colony Let's Play already well underway. Um, so yeah, I need to find well, I need to find a, sh um, a a basic shack run from a chest, and I've also found that blueprint. Oh, this is this is going well. Um, anyway, yeah, as I was trying to say, oh look at him, he's in lava, poor little guy. 
As I was trying to trying to say, um, I need to find a place to start a colony that's fairly flat and safe. So far, nowhere safe. Oh, it's raining fire. Oh, good. This is going to go south very quickly. Right, come on. Let's let's have a bit more look around the planet. Everywhere's so lumpy. It's a lumpy old planet. What a prick. Oh, oh, what the hell? Oh god, it's a matey boy. Uh, a bandit. Oh, 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 ow, 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 ow. Die, die. Oh yeah, that's right. Um, the um the baddies should fight the other baddies. That's um that's um appreciated muchly. God, there's so many enemies. Hang on. Oh! <laughs> In fact, yeah, let's just let's just shoot them all. Let God sort them out. <laughs> Oh, just dick off. That weapon is not as powerful as I thought, that sword. Uh, the, the gun, sorry. No, just die. Die! No, 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 don't do that to me. That is a wrong thing to do. You're a wrong un. You're a hooded wrong un. Right, never mind about that. Let's go back down. Um, go around to the left-hand side of the planet this time. Because that was not looking good. Uh, right, what's over here? Yep, got some good old tech here. I've also got um this... Uh, hang on, where's the button? F. Oh, <laughs> yeah, it's a teleport. Uh, but you can only teleport in line of sight. Otherwise, you walk into a wall. Uh, okay, so everything's fine. Oh, this might be a good place. Um, that's a fairly sedate-looking valley, uh, with opportunity to explore down below, by the looks of it. It's not a very big valley, though. Um, what'll do? Hang on. Die. 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 I'm going to put down a little flag. Um, where's my flag? There it is. Which means I can teleport back here um, if I decide that this is going to be the place um, to be, to build my house. I'm hoping to find a slightly bigger valley, because this one's a bit small. And the I think the, the, the colony will be kind of vertical, <laughs> if I'm not careful. Right. Oh, another explodey, poofy one. Keep it well away from... Oh! 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 Oh, that's a sneaky little shit. That... that how did I manage to thread that needle? That's a small... <laughs> hang on. Hang on. Let's um, let's stop that happening again. In fact, let's let's mark that out as a um, potential death spot. And you, and you. Right, I'm gonna carry on looking around this planet, and I'll check in again once I actually find something. Yes, one of. Oh, it's an up in the air one. Okay, that's fine. Well, maybe I should take this over and use it as my colony. And there's all the usual people up here. I don't know. It won't be a proper colony. I think I can't really um. Yeah. There's all these other people upstairs, but... Oh! That was a big fall. No, I'm not going to... Oh, no! Oh, 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 I'm going to die again. Uh, in fact, sod it. Ow! Yeah. I don't like this planet. <laughs> um, let's try... Let's actually start trying to build this colony, anyway. Oh, I haven't, I haven't named the flag. Oh, that's annoying. Um, you, you have to name the flag before you're allowed to teleport to it. Um, okay, that's fine. Um, it wasn't too far away from the start area, was it? What we'll do is we'll put down this, and we'll do it the, the the quick way. Oh dear, this is this is a steamy old pile of junk, isn't it? Oh, this isn't going to last very long. Oh, it's all crappy and steamy. They're very fragile, these things. Right. Ow! Ow, ow, ow! There it is. There it is. Fine. Right. Ugh. Might have to go and get that repaired at some point. I'm pressing the wrong thing. Oh, there we go. Okay. So, let's um, actually give this a name. Fire Colony. Two. Right. Okay. So that's some. That's going to be our beaming point for, um, to start with. Then we're going to replace it with a teleporter later on. We will have to go to the outpost for a teleporter and also to repair our crappy hover bike. Um, so let's build a house. Um, what materials do I have? Uh -huh. Not many. Dirt. A small amount of alien rock. Uh, lots of snow. And ice. All right, let's go with the snow and ice thing. Um, <laughs> um, let's make hell freeze over. Yes. Right. Okay. So this is going to have to be a fairly vertical colony. So it might be a, there might be a bit of stacking going on. Uh, kill that. In fact, I know what we'll do. Um, I've I've got some defense turrets I think left over from my snow colony. Is that it? Yeah. So let's just let's just plonk down like a couple. Just so whilst whilst I'm building. Move that out of the way. I'm not being attacked from every single side possible. Can I put that there? Yep, I can. Yes. Okay, so I'm going to be a bit more defended now whilst I build this. Right, let's, um, let's flatten out the ground. Up. 
Um, let's, um, yeah, okay, let's do a bit more. Oh, no, it's snow. and I've just destroyed the... Oh, the turret's gone. <laughs> the turret has indeed gone. Back into its component bits. Uh, okay, let's put that there instead. Oh, yep, yep, yep. Already it's, it's been put to use and it's taken absolutely no bloody... Oh, my God. Turrets! You terrible tits. There we go. I have to do it myself. Right, yeah, so let's clear out a bit of this valley. And there we go. Is that the right? Oh, that's actually rock. Oh, that's going to take ages. Come on. Yeah, that'll do. Sod it. Right, do it down there. And just clean out that bottom bit, actually, because that's... Uh, uh, in fact, the whole thing can, can come off. There we go. A nice, icy base. Like that. It'll do. Right. So, yep, a fairly flat house. Um, let's put in background. I think it's four I need. Actually, I need to go... I need to might flick over into snow because I run out of ice quite quickly. Well, presumably, is this, this is snow that can fall to bits, is it? Oh, it's fine. It, it'd only fall to bits if I started playing around with it too much. Um, right. So, yeah, my... I'll get some better building materials later on. Um, this is just going to be like um, my first house, and it's going to be nice and straightforward. Uh, this is just so I can attract my first tenant, uh, and make it feel like we've started um, properly. Oh, hang on. Let's just get rid of this. This is junk background, which I don't really want. I'm going to put some... Well, I'll just go for the the, um, the usual thing. Just put lots of wood in. Hey, Wood. That baddie is still flapping about the place up there. Turrets are doing absolutely nothing at the moment. Thanks, turrets. You're most helpful. I'm nearly done. I think that's it. Um, you still need to put in the door, don't I? Oh! <laughs> you tricks a little shit. Oh, get out of the wall. There we go. Um, just <laughs> bodge job that. Well, I think I've got a couple of doors, have I? I did last time I looked. Uh, no, I haven't. I've got a chest. I've put, let's put a weapons chest. No, actually, that's, that's too big. Let's put that chest in there. No, I don't have any bloody, bloody... Bloody, bloody doors. Okay, where's a door? There's a sliding door. I can put in a sliding door. That'll do. Uh, get rid of that. Oh, you... God, I hate it. <laughs> right, put that in there. Does this need five? I think it does. I think it needs, it needs an extra bit of thing. There. It, oh, has it gone in? I think there's some snow there. Ah, oh, fuck it. It'll do. Right, there we go. Um, there's my first house. I know it's a pile of shit. I know that. Um, right, let's. Oh! No. Right. Let's put in a second floor, so to speak. Get rid of that. Uh, very basic indeed. Now, I don't want to furnish it with. Um, I've, I've got a couple of things in my inventory, I think. Just like. Um, what is it? A hive bed? Uh, and a couple of other things as well. But don't really want any of that. Um, I think we'll need to go to the um, outpost and get some good furniture. Well, yeah, from Froggy. And we'll also do... Oh, it's raining ash. And then we'll... Yeah, we'll also... We'll get some We'll get some specified furniture from Froggy. Get our thing repaired. Where's our thing gone? Neo Chakram. Oh, yeah, I actually need to do that, don't I? Before I, before I forget and put it in the bin or something. There, now I've learnt how to craft the Neo Chakram. Right, let's, let me just find this... What's a boat? Not a boat. That'll be useful if you ever need to float through lava. <laughs> Which I'm sure we'll be doing lots of. Okay, so there's my thing I need to repair. Okay. Right. Uh, let's leave it for the time being. Oh, hang on. That's not gonna, that's not gonna melt the snow, I presume. Um, just wanna make sure. <laughs> I don't want things to... Oh! Oh, it... Bollocks. Oh, no! No! No, 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 put out the fire, put out the fire. Oh, no, the... Oh, oh no, snow. Oh, and the ice as well. Oh! Ah, uh, 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 you fucking fire, 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 fire. Fuck, fuck. Wave my butterfly net at it. Waft it out. Oh, fuck. Oh, my first house. No, you... Donkey! My door's fallen off and everything. Fucking turret's done nothing. Oh, everything's burning. Everything. Oh, what a load of shit. There used to be a house here. <laughs> <sighs> right, I've come over to the outpost. Um, let's do a few chores. 
Hooray! Um, first things first, let's actually get a teleporter. Um, I think I've already got quite a few cores um, from previous um, um, endeavours. So I just need to buy... Let's just build... I haven't got as much money as I really feel like I should have. I'm just going to buy the one for now. Uh, I'll buy the brass one. A nice little steampunky type thing. Right, okay, so that's 5,000 pixels I've got left, which ain't great. Uh, this is where you repair your number six, a red hoverbike controller. Um, right, have I got any chips? That might be um, quite important. Um, auto chips three. I think I might need a couple more, actually. So, auto chips, still very cheap. Um, let's just buy a handful. There we go. Right. Now, um, last time we saw this, um, it was um, a work in progress. Um, now it's been improved a bit. Um, so, put that in there. And we need to put in our thing. And this should repair it back up to full strength. Nine, eight, seven, seven. Oh, it only used up three. Oh, that's, <laughs> I had three in the first place. Oh, oh well, never mind. Okay, so that's now less shitty, um, and we'll actually do what we want it to do. Right, um, I think we've done everything there. We've done everything at the teleporter thing. Now we need to go and buy some good furniture. Um, for the first one, I just, I'm just going to buy, just basically buy some, rather than go to another planet. Um, although I do want to go to another planet to get some more building materials. Um, colony deeds, I've actually got quite a few of those, so I don't need any more. Um, the featured furniture is currently lots of kitcheny type stuff. Okay, um, we'll... Just buy loads of that then, I guess. Lots of these um, good kitchen cabinets. Shout out to Jay Rayner. A wall cabinet. A s small one. Um, nice little shelf. Uh, shame we haven't got a house to put any of this in. Um, and that'll do, I think. Um, I think I've already got a few of these outdoor furniture type things, so I don't need to buy any more of that. And I've got a deed. Right, so I'll go back to my... Uh, no, actually, no. I'm not going to go back to my colony just yet. Yeah, okay, let's go... I've got so many places I could actually go to rather without moving my ship. Um, <laughs> go back to my... Uh, this this is a bit of a cheat. Um, I'm going to go to my other colony, the one that's already um, set up. This is the one with the bad frame rate and everything attacking from the air. Right, hopefully... God, the frame rate sucks! Oh my god. Hopefully I've got some... Oh, I've got some gothic stuff. Oh, that might be nice. Um, but not now. Um, hopefully, is there any building materials here? No, this is that's all just gunk. Uh, I could just start tearing everything up. Um, hmm. I could tear down my existing houses. Oh, look at all this good stuff that I spent so long doing. Ah, uh, oh, look at that. Oh yes. Um, also, put turrets absolutely everywhere since last time I played. Um, oh, he's trying to give me a quest. Uh, I've probably made a bit of a mistake here because this is all snow. Um. I don't want any more snow because, well, you know. So I need to find an... Oh, hello. Yep, here we go. Um, I need to find a different biome. Let's, um, let's make a bioluminescent house. So I just need to mine out some stuff. There, over to the right, is one of the reasons why I don't like this colony. Because it's got those bastards. Those, again, go through walls. But, as it turns out, a volcano colony is going to be set with that sort of thing anyway. So we're a bit fucked either way. Uh, I don't really want to spend much time on this bloody low frame rate planet of death. Right, come on. Nearly got enough. I'm just building out. The big thing is is actually background, isn't it? And because that tends to use up the most um, of your material. Uh, okay, that'll do. Sod it. That'll be enough for our new bioluminescent, hopefully protected from fire house. All right. Fire colony two. That's the one. And off we go. Yeah, okay, so we should actually um, get rid of that flag now and put in our new teleporter. I should probably build a little teleporter house because I feel that's the way to do it. So we'll, we'll do a bit of practice, uh, first of all. Uh, 216 ain't much. Um, this will be a practice to see if it actually stands up against the elements. Um, I kind of like want to be able to explore that later, so I'm going to leave that as a little way down. In fact, better idea still is put this in an or a sli you know, slightly away from the action. Um, hmm. He's um, he's the action. Oh! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Up! Up in the air! God, this is this planet's lethal. Ah! Uh, stupid procedure generator bastard! You're not procedure generated. You're a wall climbing thing, me. Right. Okay. So this is going to be a very rough and ready uh, house of a uh, rather shit nature, I'm afraid. Uh, I don't really want to mine out the landscape because it's um, really hard to do. 
Just die. There we go. Seven. I really must get out of the habit of saying what number I'm pressing when I'm going onto my hotbar. It's a bit weird. Right. Okay, so just do that up in the air. Teleporters are quite tall. Die! Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, don't go over there. Sod you then. Right, so this is going to be wonky as hell, but I am prepared to change things around later on as we progress. Um, in fact, better idea still, sod the door. I'm going to put in a wooden platform instead. Come on, wooden platform. There we go. That's seven. I've done it again. Stop saying it. Okay, um, wood. Uh, I don't really want to put in a wooden background because that tends to explode. Um, okay, so it's just going to be a really, really yellow house. Say, so this isn't really a very important house. This is just the teleportation shack. Um, hmm, hang on. No, I don't like... I don't like that. <laughs> I'm going to have to fix it. Uh, yep. Round here, round here. Uh, ha. Ha. And ha. And ha. Yes. Everything is fine. Let's put in a teleporter. And where is the teleporter that I bought not five minutes ago? Is it a furniture? It is a furniture, yes. Right, move that. Put that in there. And we have ourselves a teleporter, which I will actually name. Right. Again, well, actually, let's call it the Volcano Colony. So it's got the canon name now. There we go. Volcano Colony, there it is. Fire Colony 2, I better delete that because that's no longer in existence. Oh, that looks so shit. Ugh. Okay, so let's rebuild this house very quickly out of different materials. Uh, I won't put you through that, so I'll see you after the edit. Okay, another rough and ready shitty house that we'll develop as we go along in this series. Um, it's a bit shit, but I've, what I've done, I've been very careful. I've put in a buffer zone of background where there's no wood all the way around here and down in front of the door, which means the fire can't get in. Um, because the fire indeed cannot burn its way through bioluminescent material. Um, the, the floor can be made of wood. There's going to be no fire there with any luck. So what I need to do now is actually start furnishing this place. So what I'll do is I'll, be, I'll move the camera there and move that over there. So that means I can easily do this using the drag and drop method. Um, so all the stuff starts here. Do it, okay, let's put down a kitchen cabinet. Put it there. A tall thing. Put that there. Um, a, a wall cabinet that can go over there. Oh, it looks like, looks like a pair of eyes. Oh, Okay, down here. In fact, let's lift, leave some room for the colony deed. Um, because I like them to be out of the door so I can collect the rent easily. I'm a bit of a hit and run landlord. I'm a right bastard, I am. Uh, some shelving. Ah, some nice little shelving there. And of course, a few bits and bobs to just leave lying about the place. Like some delicious bread. Um, which can go... Ah, sod it. There. Um, put in the colony deed. Oh, actually, we need some... How do I get a, a chef? I think to get a chef, I do actually need... I don't, this furniture alone won't do it. I think I need a kitchen table proper. And I feel like it should be a chef who lives here. So I need to build a crafting table. Oh, hang on, let's have a look. Um, a modern table. A nano stove, maybe? Would that do? Okay, let's actually see what happens when I just um, put in the deed. Um, see if actually I don't think this will actually attract a chef. No, heartbringer, somebody or other. It's a guy who appears to have a melted loaf of bread on his head. So maybe he is a chef. Uh, I don't know. Um, fresh food is a. Oh, hello. No, he is. He is food related. He actually is food related, but is not a chef. Um, that's fine. Um, uh, I'll probably finish up with some pictures and other decoration later on. He'll probably need a bed. That's a good point. Oh, sorry, I'll just use a hive bed that I was, I, was, I was trying to avoid using. There, now you can have a good kip um, if you really want. Um, in fact, sod it, you can also have the, the unicorn plushie. Uh, I don't know how I got that. I think it dropped from a colony quest, oddly enough. Okay, so I need to do a couple more tweaks and then we'll finish up. Um, next time we'll we'll start building um, houses that will attract guards and things like that. Because this colony will be need to be heavily defended from all these flying things. First of all, I'm going to build a pit in front of the house. Um, that's to stop fire spreading across the threshold. And also, on a similar vein, um, let's see. I really should be using bio... Oh, what's he doing? Oh no, I was going to build a little sort of 
a little sort of um, overhang there. But these guys are going to be able to climb over them. Oh, I don't want you on there. Uh, okay, look, he'll be able to actually climb. Oh, don't, don't interact. Oh, it's okay. It's okay. The turret is very, very slowly killing it. Oh, you little turd. Oh, no! What the fuck? Lads. Lads. <laughs> Lads. My house broke again. I think it was... I think that was a meteor strike. Oh, what the living donkeys. Fuck! Fuck, 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 fuck. <laughs> We've achieved nothing! We've achieved literally nothing in this entire bloody Let's Play. Oh, I need to work this. I need to I need to find something that's stronger. I need to find a, a much stronger material. <laughs> God damn it, that, that escalated quickly. <laughs> Fuck! Sod. Okay. We'll have to stop here. <laughs> right, okay, so, in the next episode, yeah, we'll try and find a way of mitigating against this sort of thing, um, and hopefully attract some guards, and we'll actually get this colony running. Hopefully. <laughs> so, um, oh god, hope my, has, has my teleporter survived? Ah, my teleporter's fine, although that seems to have developed some additional blocks. <laughs> I think that might be Meteor Rock. Is that Meteor Rock? It is Meteorite Rock. Oh, I've never seen that before. Cool. <laughs> right, okay, so yeah, subscribe for more videos in this series and other Starbound stuff. Um, and yeah, and other, lots of other videos about the early Access Alpha games, Weird Indie, and stuff like that. Oh, it's starting to rain ash again. Bollocks! Oh, anyway, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.